darkness. Someone tried to hack the Pentagon. I have to stop this. It's game over. Toby, Marley, Jeff in Las Vegas, good morning. Hi. Good morning. Thank you for joining me today about Alex Ryder season two. I'm about three episodes in. You know what I love about this show? It's so English. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I just, I love the pacing of it. I love the dialogue. I mean, I not only am I having a great adventure, but I feel like I'm totally out of my comfort zone. I'm just like in another culture, in another world. So that's what I, one of the aspects I love about this show is very English. <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> And Toby, playing a tech billionaire, uh, did you research the role? Did you hang out with Elon Musk or Bill Gates? Sadly, they were busy, but, um, <laughs> uh, I, you know. Um, well, I mean, also, I'm, I'm a bit of an outlier because I'm, I'm a very rare thing. I'm a British tech billionaire. We don't really do those. So apart from Dyson, who makes kind of vacuum cleaners, <laughs> I don't think we have a tech billionaire. So I was just like, it, it, was, it was sort of like, I had to kind of base it on what I kind of imagined them to be, you know. Well, I met two billionaires in my lifetime, uh, Kirk Kikorian, you know, MGM and Ted Turner. Oh, wow. And uh, you you exude a billionaire's attitude. So I want you to, you, you did something. Oh, good. Right. <laughs> That's it. And, and Marley, you know, state of, state of the art game console called Game Slayer, the first game, Feathered Serpent, there's more than meets the eye in this game, isn't there? Yes, yes. I'm not really allowed to reveal that, but um, it's definitely something that would intrigue Kyra. It's very much up her street, video games, and um, figuring out something that might lie beneath a video game. So um, it's, it'd be interesting to see what comes of that. And your character is right on top of it, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, she's definitely um, super interested in, in the video game. And when she gets brought back into Alex's world, she um, is definitely recruited because she can be a, a lot of help trying to figure out what's going on with the video game. And Toby, tell me about working with Anthony Horowitz. Was it a great collaboration? You know, if you had questions about your character to, to deal with the author and executive producer? Well, yeah, I mean, I, I actually know Anthony. Uh, I've, I've known him for quite a while socially. Um, and I've been, always been a huge admirer of him. I mean, he's such a prolific writer. And, you know, he's such a great guy. And, uh, but it, the, the character as filmed is very different from the character in the book. It has some similarities, but it's a very different deal. I mean, I, I read the book and he's a very different person. So um, it was, this is a much more kind of uh, current modern version of that character. And Marley, were you encouraged to read Eagle Strike, the, sec the fourth book in the series and which the series two is based on? Yeah, when I found out that's what series two is based on, also we had COVID, we had like a big massive break. Um, I couldn't wait because I was like, okay, now I can actually find out a little bit about it because there is the book to read. So yeah, it was, it was a, but it's obviously based off and then they, they have a lot of creative license to like, so I was interested to see what they would take and what they would leave. And um, I think they did a really good job of, of both. Well, Toby, Marley, congratulations on season two. And uh, thank you for joining me today. I wish you the best of luck in the series. And let's talk again soon. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Very much.